Dozens come together in Southfield to take a stand against hate. The Anti-Defamation League held its walk against hate at the Southfield Civic Center. As Megan Woods shows us, the event is more than just a walk. It's really an opportunity to build toward a future without bigotry and more inclusion. Before people start walking, they stop at this table to make a sign so people passing by know their message. Michigan is no place for hate. The Anti-Defamation League, also known as ADL, is a national organization. Carolyn Normandon is the Michigan Regional Director. I see a lot of strollers. I see a lot of young people, people from all walks of life, all different ages, all different ethnicities. What they're saying together is Michigan stands up against hate. It doesn't stop there. Today, a group of more than 200 people gathered in front of the Southfield Civic Center to walk two miles for ADL's walk to end hate. No place for hate. No place for hate. You have to figure out how to navigate the way out of it and move forward. And that's what this walk is about. It's about education. It's about providing resources to people. This is the second year the walk is in person. And this year, organizers say there are a lot more youth participants. Madison Zorath is one of them. The ninth grader came with her mother after getting inspired last October. But there was actually a lot of bullying going on at my school and we wanted to do something to stop it. So we had an anti-bullying rally at my school and the ADL came and spoke and then we heard about this and we've been like coming and supporting them. She's raised about $800 for the walk to end hate and hopes to inspire other young people. I feel like kids don't really like feel like they can do a lot, but really they can. This is a statewide effort. They have people participating in Petoskey and Grand Rapids. In Southfield, I'm Megan Woods, Local 4.